Thank you for stopping by and checking out my little 118th Wolverine custom from the Deadpool Wolverine movie. This movie was great. It was so cool to finally see Hugh Jackman in a quasi comic book accurate costume. This Wolverine was a blast to build. It was such a great movie. I was really inspired to build this Wolverine. This Wolverine has a O-ring design. I stay away from the ball joints when I make these little figurines. An O-ring design gives it such playability, lets you have such a great ab crunch. You're really able to pose your little Wolverine like in the comic books or in this new movie. That movie costume was so complicated. It had all sorts of little colors that you wouldn't normally see in a 118th design. So it was very technical to try to get all these little colors in here. I did the highlights in the gloves. These hands come from a Marvel Capcom Ryru. I cut off the nubs and drilled them out, inserting a Joy Toy wrist joint for that 360 movement in the wrist. In the Wolverine Deadpool movie, Wolverine has some really cool boots. I really enjoyed the design of those. So to get those, I used this Joy Toy leg. I made a press mold using epoxy putty. I inserted the joints when I made the mold so they could fit in as I lay in the epoxy. So therefore I don't have to do any like grinding or cutting to try to get a joint to pop in. It's already made into the leg. For these claws, I used some thin gauge aluminum, measured out the forearm, cut a slit in the knuckles, and just glued them on in. I love the design of them. They look absolutely savage. And one of the greatest parts of this movie is when Hugh Jackman donned the mask. The entire theater just exploded in celebration. Everybody just lost their mind at that moment. It was so cool. But just to get a feel of what a movie accurate costume would look like, is the Wolverine masked head. I know it's not a Hugh Jackman head. Just to get a feel for what it would look like, I went ahead and popped this head right on. It looks pretty cool. I'm impressed with it. I absolutely enjoy the posability that the O-ring design gives these figures. This was a real joy to create for you guys. If you had as much fun watching this video as I did making it, give a thumbs up and share this video with somebody interested in custom building. I really appreciate you stopping by and please come back soon. Atel Prasma. Ciao.